Hello, my name is Don Liu. I'm a docent at the Modern Art Museum of Fort Worth, and we are looking at Drape by the artist Joseph Havel, completed in 1999. I frequently lead tours down the back stairs from the second floor of the museum to the lower level galleries, and as we round the corner at the bottom of the stairs, we are confronted with a floating, almost ghost-like drape in the middle of the floor. Upon closer inspection, it appears to be a freestanding drape, almost 10 feet tall. I always stop and ask how people think the drape can just stand there. This is usually followed by several suggestions, such as the material is covered with paste or cement, or there is a stand underneath, all of which are also regrettably wrong. In fact, we are looking at an incredibly heavy bronze statue. The artist who created this work, Joseph Havel, lives and works in Houston, Texas. Much of his work focuses on transforming fabric items from everyday use into sculptures. These works include, in addition to our drape, men's white shirts, clothing labels, bed sheets, tablecloths, and many other items. Havel hangs an item of interest in his studio, with gravity choosing the desired shape. He makes sketches, takes photographs, and when satisfied with the shape of the object, covers the fabric with wax to stiffen it and ready it for casting. The fabric is cut into sections, over 70 sections for this statue alone. A bronze casting is made of each section using the lost wax method, preserving the surface texture. The sections are then welded together, recreating the original shape. The surface is buffed to remove the weld seams, and the final finish color is developed using chemicals applied to the casting. I urge you to make a point of going down the back stairs to the lower level and looking at the floating drape as you round the corner at the bottom of the stairs. You will now know the secret of how it stands ghost-like in the middle of the floor.